are we heading towards a type 1 civilization if yes then when when and do you think there is life after death <clears throat> sorry <clears throat> so the type 1 civilization on the kardashev scale is a civilization that is able to control and harness all the energy and resources of its home planet so it means that this civilization should be able to control the weather it should be able to control the oceans it should be able to control all the energy output that is potentially available on the planet all the natural gas all the petroleum all the volcanic energy all the wind energy all the thermal energy everything so as of now we are very far away from being a type 1 civilization we are not heading towards it we are actually messing up our planet we are making it difficult to for for our uh, descendants and future generations to have a good life on this planet and uh, so so we are quite far from being a type 1 civilization will we achieve it in the future i as of now i think it's quite difficult we need to really turn our ways around and become more efficient and less wasteful in in the way we uh carry out our our day to day lives especially the west which has this uh, this culture of disposability everything is disposable in the west use something once and throw it so that is the kind of thing that is destroying our planet and that is one of the things and one of the world views that is preventing us from progressing in the direction of becoming a type 1 civilization so we would have to become more efficient and more uh and we would need to treat nature and our resources with more respect and stop treating earth as a as a dustbin and then only we can think of trying to move in that direction so that's the answer um do i think there is life after death <laughs> i ha- i have no idea honestly i don't know is there life after that is there consciousness after the after death the living body definitely dies decays right but does consciousness persist in some form after death that is the big question um according to the many worlds theory of of quantum mechanics there is something called uh, there's a thought experiment called quantum suicide i would suggest you guys read up about that so that kind of suggests that there could be quantum immortality and maybe consciousness could persist after the physical body dies that is one of the possibilities that emerges out of the theory of quantum mechanics out of one of the interpretations of quantum mechanics so who knows we as of now we don't really understand quantum mechanics at all there we understand how to use it but we don't understand what it, what it is telling us maybe there are missing pieces of information missing pieces of the, of the puzzle maybe we aren't intelligent enough to reach the correct level of understanding so as of now we do not have answers to that question is there life after death and does consciousness persist after death we don't know as of now